So what time, like whether you were in the lab, like what was that turning point when you decided or made a decision to start a company and why cannabinoid? Like what made you decide, let's start with cannabis product and then (laughs) two other agriculture products or? I think the moment I decided to start a company was back when I was finishing up my undergrad. I was, you know, had done a good like thesis project, did some research in a lab there with a professor and stuff. Mm -hmm. And when we were talking about careers for future scientists, that was where like I would have you know, there was a slide that my professor put up on the screen uh, that said like, oh, like you can go to industry or you can go to academia. Uh, and that was, those are the options. And then you also hear things about the academic journey where it's like, well, like, you know, one in 10, you know, graduates will actually find a job in research kind of yeah. thing after you do your PhD. So it didn't look like a very like, you know, friendly journey to go on that path and still not really end up where you want to be after all. Because all I really wanted to do was like do my own research project and like, you know, invent cool solutions like the one with Hyacinth essentially. So after my just after my undergrad um, a few friends of mine started their own company that was doing uh, genetic engineering toolkits Mm -hmm. and they caught my eye and I worked for them for a summertime Mm -hmm. Uh, and that gave me like the seed of like understanding like what is the startup journey like Mm -hmm. and what can you do with that 